This morning we're headed offshore and we're going to be fishing for Spanish mackerel. They've been really thick lately. I also think there's some big sharks mixed in with the Spanish mackerel, so if we're lucky, we may see a big shark as well. Today, we're going to be fishing with Corey from Tackle Crackers. How's it going, dude? Good, man. Excited to fish. You ready to eat some Spanish mackerel I'm, tonight? I'm ready. Once we find the school, we're gonna stop and start casting lures, and the goal is to limit out both of us on Spanish mackerel, 15 a piece. There we go, fish on. All right. Oh man, Spanish mackerel. Nice one, dude. Oh my gosh, really nice one. Nice. First Spanish of the day, woo! You can look at those teeth. Those teeth are just insane. Really cool. They got some yellow spots on them. And uh, they're good eating. They're also good bait, too. After I catch a Spanish mackerel, I always check the leader and make sure it's frayed. Sometimes they miss the lure and you'll feel a little nicks in your line. This one's pretty good. I like to leave this trace right there just in case, you know, so if you get a real big one, they don't bite you off as easy. This is only 20 pound fluorocarbon. Oh, there we go, fish on. All right. Oh, did I lose him? Oh, I lost him, shoot. Oh my gosh, look how many Spanish mackerel just followed me in. Dude, so many. I got, I got <laughs> oh, oh, another one hit me. Dude, there's just so many of them. Ah, I got another one. <laughs> At first I thought those were Spanish mackerel. Dude, that's crazy. It's a big school of little jacks, man. Nice little jack. <laughs> I'll get on your boat. There's thousands of them. There we go, fish on. All right, finally. It's been a while, guys. Man, they're all chasing the one that's hooked. It's crazy. I think he's foul hooked. Another Spanish mackerel right there. So let's put them in the box. Boom. There you go. They are like it. They like the jig. Fish on. All right. I'm double tapping it. Oh, it's a good one. Oh, he got off. Shoot. There we go. Fish on. <laughs> Dude, this is the jigs, man. The answer. It's a good size Spanish. Oh man, that's a that's a beauty right there. It's a nice Spanish mackerel. If you would calm down, let me hold them. Beautiful. Look at that Spanish. Look at those teeth, guys. And they're fish on right now. Watch this. So what I'm doing is I'm just letting it sink. Tap tap. Let's sink. Tap tap. Tap tap. There, oh, just missed one. Just missed one. Oh, just had another one. Tap tap. I'm, I'm doing the same exact thing. It's just the magic, bro. I don't know what to tell you. It's that. Oh, oh. Fish on. Oh. I, I don't know if you guys can see them, but there is thousands of them down there. Thousands of Spanish mackerel. They're just roaming around. How are you doing so far? Trying not to let my ego get to hurt too bad right now. You need to get on the board, bro. <laughs> Fish on. Fish on. All right. Finally on the board here. Good size Spanish, man. As look at the colors on this fish. See the spots on the on the side of their body, and look at their teeth. Those teeth are gnarly, bro. Now we can see hundreds of them down there, and um, we were throwing some different lures. Nothing was working. Gotcha jigs and the little bucktails seem to be the only thing that they're they're chewing on right now. Oh, yeah. It's a beautiful morning. Oh, oh. boom. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. That's a good one. <laughs> That's a good one. Got to keep tight. Yeah, That's a nice one. 
it's number uh, number eight or nine. Catch them on almost top water, guys. We got we're getting them chummed up right now, and they are just ridiculous to hold. Let's put him in a, a box right here. All right. Dude, they like the shrimp, man. Oh, sorry. They like the shrimp. That one in there does not want to die. We got to double up, Josh. There we go. Oh. Oh, dude, they're smacking it, dude. I have, I have a nice one, dude. <laughs> Beauty. <laughs> it's a good one, too. Oh, is that a bite? Oh, they're all over here, Dust. Oh. Here. Oh. Dude, big bull shark. Big bull shark right here. Look, look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Big bull shark. Here, let's keep him around. Caught about a dozen Spanish mackerels, and uh, now we got some big bull sharks hanging around the boat. So, you know what that means? It's shark time. There we go. That's a lemon right there. I want him. The Spanish mackerel have disappeared. The sharks have disappeared. It's time for us to move, find a new spot, and try to find a new school of fish. We had a big one on. Oh, he's foul hook. He's still a good size. Look at that. Oh, he's good. The last spot, the clear water, wasn't doing us much good. But this dirty water, they are biting a lot better, guys. Big shark, big shark, big shark, big shark, big shark. Back, bro. Let's catch, let's catch that shark right now, bro. I was not hoping to catch an earth shark. There was a giant rough tail stingray down there and I was hoping to get that. But Mr. Gummy had to ruin my plans, so it is what it is. Is it a goliath, bro? That's what I'm saying, dude. I saw a goliath. I think I saw a goliath down there. That's a goliath? It is a goliath, dude. Okay. Let's see what it is. Let's catch the goliath on the freaking real rod, dude. Because on that spinning rod, that'd be brutal. Let's do this. There's a Goliath grouper underneath the boat right now. I'm gonna catch him. It's already been a sick day. Oh yeah, let's make it sicker though. Hmm? Let's make it sicker. Oh, oh, he's on me. He's gonna get it. He's gonna get it. Oh, he's gonna eat it. There's two of them down there. Oh. He's got it. Get the, get, the, get the camera. I think we got a nibble. Uh oh, trying to get me, trying to get me. I think so. Let's go full drag. Here he comes. Oh man, there he goes. <laughs> Pop the wire, bro. There's the first blooper of 2016. Looks fine. Wasn't hooked good. Dude, that was crazy. Can't believe how many there are down there, dude. Can't believe he got off. We got Goliath number two on right here. No! Not you again! Are you kidding me? Oh, you stupid dummy shark. You know, when I said I wanted to catch sharks, I did not mean nurse sharks, but I'll take them. But that's the bottom of the food chain in the shark world, guys. Oh, more head shakes. Could it be? Could it be another gummy? That's only time will tell. I'm, I'm guessing gummy now, because I just crushed them so fast. I have the grandfather, grandfather nurse shark on here. Oh, it sure is. Another gummy. At least he's put up a fight. At least he's put up a fight. I mean, could be worse. Could have already landed him like the other one. Oh, he's right. 
freaking gummies, guys. Look at that gummy. Why can't these gummies just leave me alone? It's like eight feet long and I beat it in two seconds. So that's three, three nurse sharks, no real sharks, one lost goliath grouper. I'm gonna keep grinding it out though. I think there's, uh, I think there's something good down there. Just gotta wait and go through the nurse sharks, that's all. We are hooked up to a big shark right now, guys. There was a, about a nine foot lemon that was swimming the boat and I was trying to get him on the 80 wide. I put out a little piece of a sardine and guess, what, guess who ate the piece of sardine? The, the nine foot lemon shark. So 4,000 size reel. Is it possible to stop a giant shark? We're gonna have to chase him down, bro. All right, I'll hold the camera. You, oh, never mind. popped off. I was really wanting to catch that shark and the 80 wide would have been the uh, choice of reel, not the 4,000 size stratic, but sometimes happens that way and it is what it is. Big shark on. Look at that, he's taking line. This one's about nine feet long, guys. <laughs> he's got me pinned. I don't know if you guys can't tell the boat's turning. Oh man. Guys, I honestly think this is my PB lemon. It's a great fish to end the day with too. In the boat, okay. Hold on. I saw him come up and eat it. I was like, oh, he's got it, the big one. The reason I'm up here also is the anchor rope. There's two reasons why I'm up here. One, the anchor rope, and two, I don't want the line getting chafed up on the bottom of the boat and the shark breaking me off. Oh, I see him. He's a big boy. Hold on. Not done yet. There he is. That's a big shark. Probably eight and a half feet. Oh, he broke off. Dude. Dude, do you understand what just happened? He just broke a 500 pound swivel. A 500 pound swivel, look at this guy. This was a swivel right here, okay? He just broke one of those, this is caught fish. I mean, he's right here. But he popped that swivel, that's 500 pounds. That's, I've never ever, caught thousand pound fish, I've never had one of these break before. It's pretty incredible. We definitely caught our limited mackerel. We caught some nurse sharks. Nothing wrong with some nurse sharks. Caught some nurses, some gummy gummy bears, gummy worms, whatever you want to call them, gummy sharks. And uh, we just caught that big lemon shark. That was a that was a great way to end the day right there. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and we'll see you next time.